Okay, something else we can do once we have gotten our white balance down is we can make sure that our exposure is just right. Actually, the exposure looks pretty good here. Uh, but you notice the picture is a little flat. Uh, a couple different ways you can deal with that. You can uh, adjust your blacks, bring that up a little bit. That'll add a little bit more contrast to your picture. Uh, I'm going to keep it at 5 here for the time being. And let's pop up our vibrance. Now, vibrance, you can always go a little bit more than saturation. Saturation tends to give you some weird color after a while. I think we're pretty safe doing maybe 50 on our vibrance or so. And let's go maybe 25 on the saturation. That should probably be plenty. 25, there we go. That gives us a nice saturated picture. Um, really vibrant and uh, it's looking better. Uh, let's go up just a little bit on our clarity. Uh, that's going to give us, again, it's going to work on mostly our contrast. I'll give a little more definition to everything that's there. Um, I don't want to go any higher than 10 on this one. Uh, so our white balance is set. If we wanted to warm it up a little bit, we could if we wanted to, but I'm, I'm happy with where it is. Um, our exposure looks pretty good. Uh, recovery, we don't need. That would just bring back any areas uh, that were getting blown out. Uh, little quick tip here for you if you're adjusting a picture in in camera raw here and you want to adjust the exposure hold down your alt key on your keyboard and then go ahead and grab your exposure and start to move it now as you see as I'm moving it to the right uh, little pieces of color are starting to pop up now everything that you're seeing here everything that's popping up that is all blown out if I let go of the alt key you see that all the definition in that is gone so I want to bring that back down to zero Actually, we'll even bring it back a little lower than zero, so everything disappears. Now you always, now well, you almost always want to see a little bit of, of something in there because you see, if we get rid of everything, it's just way too dark. Uh, this picture really isn't uh, uh, where I want it to be right now, so we're going to put it to we're going to zero it back out there and and bring it up. So we have our exposure good, uh, recovery is not necessary, fill light. Is going to flatten out our picture a little bit, but uh, let's bring it maybe just maybe just 10. And our blacks are good. Uh, brightness and contrast, I'm not going to touch because I'll be dealing with that in the next video. Uh, clarity and vibrance and saturation are all set pretty good. So we've improved our picture a little bit. Let's go ahead and click on our preview. That's the old one. That's the new one. See how that background really pops out really nice too. Uh, so we got a little, little, little contrast, a little saturation, a little vibrance, and it's all looking pretty good. So we're gonna actually play with something in the advanced menus next.